Today is Monday, May 25th, and this is the view that's greeted us in lovely Mykonos. We're on the rooftop patio of the Spinellis Hotel. We got an early start with breakfast where the hotel set out a nice little buffet. Spano Copita, Spano Copita for breakfast. I, we're in Greece and I still don't know how to say it. But look, that's what we're having. And I dare say this is much better than the Costco version. The view is nicer than when I usually eat Spano Copitas. Mm. Yum. <clears throat> it is a nice day. We're gonna go to the beach today, right? Mm -hmm. Where are we going? What did you find? Fairly a beach. Yeah? And why did you choose it? Because they have an Indian restaurant at the beach. <laughs> they have an Indian restaurant. Best on the Greek islands, so we're gonna try it out. How do you know it's the best on the Greek islands? We don't know. We'll find out. This is how <laughs> Ken chooses a beach to go to. He found the one with an Indian restaurant. Like, who does that? Um, my criteria was umbrellas. They have to have umbrellas. As you all know, I can't be on the beach or in the sun for a long period of time without some sort of shade. So that's the one we settled on. You'll see pictures later. So we rented another Fiat Panda for our day at the beach. In case you're interested, the Indian Palace restaurant is just east of Paradise Beach. There might have been another sign for Paradise Beach, but this is the one I remembered. Paradise Beach offered a set of lounge chairs and an umbrella for 50 euro for the day. And it had a cafe area with plenty of selections. This guy was not on the menu, but it was cool to see him in the water. Oh, look. Hello. Look what I found. More Greek aquatic island wildlife, and this duck is coming right for me. Hi. What are you doing, bud? Beautiful sight, right? Came here to look at the view. Quack, quack. After exploring the shore, it was time to lay back and relax. My girls have said that Ken looks like a sea otter when he floats around in the water. What do you think? Meanwhile, I am a brick just struggling to keep my head above the water. So this was the bulk of our day. We just laid back and watched the day go by. We headed over to the Indian Palace around 4 or 5 o'clock. We are at the Indian Palace, which serves the best Indian food in Greece. And there's Paradise Beach right over here, where we, where we spent, what, the last six four hours, hours, four hours? Maybe five. What time is it? Four or five hours. Almost five. Yeah. And Ken chose. Paradise Beach because of this Indian Palace restaurant. Look at that. Get try it. It's got a lot to live up to, honey. Mm. But I'll tell you what, that Paradise Beach lived up to its name, wouldn't you say? It did. Yeah, it was pretty nice. Water was nice. A little cool, but you Wash got facilities, showers, and places to eat. And everything you need just to hang out at the beach. And Drinks. Uh, and the young people can party from 4 to, I don't know what it is, 1 or 2 in the morning. It looks like. And it was affordable. So pictures of cocktails. So. And it was That's affordable. It was made for a party. <laughs> right? Yeah. That was. Yeah. We got one Euro to snack on. Uh, and it. this guy, this guy, was very impressed with the price. All right, honey, what's the verdict? Very good. It's a different flavor from our um, Virginia cooking, I guess. So, is this a good way to choose a beach? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> 
see how she got lucky. Found a nice beach. That's an Indian food too. <laughs> it is pretty good. I got the chicken, no, I got the fish tikka, and you got the butter chicken. Butter chicken. Yeah. Different flavors from our food, our Indian food mm -hmm. in Virginia. After dinner, we went back to our hotel so we could change and stroll through town and do some shopping. We were just strolling through downtown Mykonos. It's very touristy in this area. You can find all manner of restaurants and shops and other touristy things in this town. And it is quite a lot busier than Knox's was. Ken decided to use Google Maps to take a shortcut and we got ourselves lost in a residential area. Are we lost? Did we go this way? We went through that Suvla Suvlaki place before. I think we, or we went past it. Where are we? Through there, maybe. Yeah. And we were back on track in the shopping district. Oh, that's Lola's right there. <laughs> All right, there it is. Isn't that it? Ken? Is that it? In the corner? Yeah. We were in search for a dress shop that I'd spotted the day before. That's not it. We went upstairs. We didn't go through there, did we? Okay. Instead, I settled for some baklava gelato. Check out this pigeon on the right in complete harmony with his feline friends. It was really heartwarming to see so many churches just open to the public. While the bars stay open well into the night, most shops and restaurants close fairly early. And that was it for our first full day of Mykonos. Thanks for coming along and stay tuned for our big day at Delos. I'll see you then. Yasas!